Hi, as Archangel Michelle, daughter of the Son, God, and as Eve, mother of all living, it is my duty and high honor to tell you the truth. I am now being T. Michelle Birdsaw. The definition for maneuver carefully guided or manipulate someone or something in order to achieve an end. The airlines manipulated the public into believing traveling through the air without ground beneath you or tracks beneath you was a safe way to go by distracting you from the dangers. The end was to make a lot of money and create an industry. Distraction, extreme agitation of the mind or emotional or emotions. He knew she was nervous by her uncharacteristic air of distraction. Similar word to distraction, frenzy, hysteria. What causes distraction? Distraction is caused by the lack of ability to pay attention, lack of interest in the object of attention or the great intensity, novelty, or attractiveness of something other than the object of attention. The object of attention was the airplane, a mechanical bird without actual wings or a safety net between it and the ground. American Airlines hired young statuesque unmarried attractive young ladies so their sex appeal natural pleasure sex is a basis for life so the young ladies sex appeal would distract the male passengers from the fa fact that they were in danger risking their lives sitting in a chair being moved through the air in a mechanical bird without real wings and without a parachute. American Airlines trained these attractive young ladies to remember names of the passengers so they, the passengers, would feel like the stewardesses knew them and liked them because they, the stewardesses, were trained to smile at the passengers be friendly to the passengers like they were family, friend, or neighbors, and talk to the passengers about themselves. Airlines. American Airlines Stewardesses College in Fort Worth, Dallas, Texas area taught the stewardesses in training how to apply expensive, the best makeup to their faces. American Airlines hired French hairstylists to come to the college and cut and style the stewardesses in training's hair. Stylists taught the stewardesses their best color to wear to complement their hair and skin color. They taught the girls to serve meals with grace and dignity. Eating is one of the favorite pleasures of life. Eating while flying was another way to distract the passenger from the danger he was in flying without wings or a parachute. The airlines didn't provide parachutes to the passengers because they didn't want to point out the danger of flying without real natural wings. When the stewardesses gained weight, they were sent to the airline's doctor who prescribed diet pills, also known as speed. If the speed made you crazy, they tried to transfer you to an office job for American Airlines after you got out of the psych ward. If a stewardess got too old to look young or reached the age minimum, the age maximum, they had to quit being stewardesses. Some were hired as supervisors or teachers in the stewardess college, a state of the arts, beautiful structure and operation. The stewardesses were taught first aid and some facts about aircrafts. They also sold alcohol in coach, the cheap seats, 
and gave it away in first class during flight. Drinking is the most popular antidote to nervousness for those who, despite the millions of dollars the airlines spent distracting folks from the reality of the dangers of air travel, still felt nervous. I was sitting in the cockpit on a smoke break one day when I saw an airplane coming at us. The pilot saw it too. He quickly dropped down a few feet without having the, taking the time. He didn't have the time to consult with the airplane traffic controllers to see if changing altitude was safe, to see if no other plane was flying at that location. The pilot had no choice but to risk changing positions, and he won the bet. We were safe. He said to me, you can tell everybody that you've experienced a near miss. Many crashes happen too and are caused by pilots who fly small aircraft. They are not well trained. They do not follow the rules. Same thing in the case same thing is the case in automobile travel. A Mack truck teacher told me most people simply do not know how to drive correctly. They do not know the rules of the road. That is why so many automobile deaths. Carelessness. The roads are crowded. The skies are crowded. Who founded American Airlines? C.R. Smith. After eight years of mail routes, the airline began to form it into what it is today. Note, a horror of TSA invading your privacy and destroying your dignity. I'm told that Amtrak train travel on tracks is safer and more pleasant than air travel. American founder C.R. Smith worked with Donald Douglas to create the DC-3 a plane that changed the entire airline industry. Industry. ING is a subway train in New York City. ING, train of thought. U.S. T-R-Y, try to fly passengers through the air and charge them a lot of money. So um, the DC-3 was a plane, plane that changed the entire airline industry, switching revenue sources from mail to passengers. So the uh, uh, industry changed the entire airline industry, switching revenue sources from mail to passengers. So the U.S. tried to fly passengers through the air and charge them a lot of money. The airlines spent a fortune having the garment district at 7th Avenue workers design extra special short dresses for the stewardesses. Air travel, as done by American Airlines, started out as a first class, classy operation. American had the best record of checking out their airplanes, making sure their parts stayed in good working order. American and the other airlines trained their stewardesses, now called flight attendants, since they started hiring males to serve the passengers also, without telling them the truth. You get that? American and the other airlines trained their stewardesses without telling them the true function of their services. The truth, the goal is to distract the passengers from the dangers they're in, being 35,000 feet in the air without wings or parachutes. Okay, so that's the end of the video. I hope you are now informed and no longer distracted, but are aware of the facts of airline travel. Thank you.